welcome to this week's weekly vlog. Today is Monday the 7th of March. We're just getting some lunch at the shop. She's got this sausage roll. He's a very happy boy. We've all just been to the dentist this morning. Alice is at the park with Daddy at the minute. And Leo didn't want to go to the park and wanted to get a sausage roll, so he came and got his sausage roll, didn't you, for his lunch. So we're going to eat this and then we're going to have a quick look around the shops. Yummy! It's so cute. Leo and I are now in the park. Here he is, just looking for Lawrence. Just looking for Lawrence and Alice, apparently they're in the little playground. So I'm just going to walk to the little playground and find them. And he's been such a good boy, haven't you? Yeah, such a good boy. Go, 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 you can run. You want to run? No, no, no. Go, hold my hand. Go, we hold hands. So we've literally got the whole park to ourselves at the minute and all these two want to do is play on the slide. <laughs> there he is. These want to push each other down the slide, don't you? Hey, ready? ready Leo's coming? Sure, come on. Oh, got Alice. <laughs> More? Quick, quick, quick. Who's going to get there first, Leo? Where are you going now, Alice?
So we are back from the park now we've all had some lunch and i am about to have a nice relaxing bath while lawrence plays whilst plays in alice Lloyd. leo's having his nap he's tired out from the park so i'm just gonna choose what i'm gonna put in my bath today i think i'm gonna use this bubble bath and i think i'm gonna go for the little mermaid bath is there. and then i might as well use this coconut little mermaid bath jelly as well so I'm gonna have a nice bath and I'll get back to you a little bit later Today is Wednesday. We didn't film anything yesterday because we just didn't do anything. But we're just about to go to school, aren't we, Alice? Taking Alice to school now. And then me and Leo are just going to knit to the local shops to get some Easter stuff in. And then Leo's got his hearing test at the hospital today. So, yeah, we're going to take Alice to school and we'll get back to you. So, we've just come to Quality Save to get some Easter stuff. Haven't we, Leo? Leo's got some little bunnies. I think that's all we're going to get for today. I think that's all we need, Leo. Yeah. I think that's everything we need. So it's now time for us to go and pick Alice up from school. Um, we haven't done much really since we got back from the shops. I did film a whole video of all the Easter stuff that I bought because we bought quite a lot of Easter stuff. Um, and then we've just been playing, so... Yeah, I'm gonna go and get Alice now. Then we'll have about, um, about an hour before my dad picks us up to take Leah to his um, hearing testing at the hospital. So I probably won't get do too much more till then. So I'll probably get back to you now, probably when we're back from the hospital. Just coming up to two o'clock. I'm just waiting for my parents to arrive. Uh, so my mum can sit with Alice and I'm gonna take Leah to his hospital appointment for his ears. So yeah, we should be leaving any minute now. Hi, today is Thursday. I'm sorry I didn't get back to yesterday after Leo's hospital appointment. We haven't ended up being I know, quite busy just playing and stuff, but yeah, he went for but yeah, he went for his hearing test. Uh, they did struggle a bit doing his hearing because he doesn't like being touched or anything and they have to put like a little thing behind the ear for one of the tests to do and they couldn't do that he just wouldn't let them do it he also has to put something in his ears check his ears and that was a nightmare to hold him down to do it um but they managed to do that in the end but what it was really interesting the way to do it what they do is they have some toys out to get him to play and then they'll put a sound on and when the sound is on they'll have a little puppet at the side with them um, they'll make a noise and light up um so they come to realize that every time there's a noise the puppet will come on so it means that they'll look that way whenever they hear a noise so that's how they do it so they know that they can hear the sounds they'll obviously look that way for the puppet because you know the puppet comes on when the sound comes on so that was how they did the test um 
He said his ears were, they had to put the sound up a bit higher than they would usually for him to be able to hear it. But he said it could be due to congestion in his ears because he has got a cold, um, which is the one they was going to put like a little thing behind the ear and that would test his hearing behind the congestion because he couldn't, wouldn't let them do that. They couldn't do it. So they want him to come back in three months time to check it. However, they said his hearing should be fine enough for him to be able to pick up speech. Um, so that shouldn't be the reason why he's not picking up speech. So, yeah, they've ruled out that I as a reason. Ding -ding. You were ding -ding? It's not lunchtime yet. I was our lunchtime. You want your lunchtime, but I think it's only like half ten, Alice. Got like at least an hour and a half yet before dinner. For lunch. Oh, Lord. What? Do you want some skips? Do you want a snack? I want a skip. Okay, I'll get you a snack. So yeah, that was his hearing test anyway. So um, he's going to go back in three months just to check it. Um, and yeah, but he said it shouldn't be um, a reason for not to be picking up speech. I have got some skips. Yeah, you want some? Are you hungry? This little girl is hungry all the time at the moment, aren't you? I wonder if she's having a growth spurt because she just wants to eat all the time, don't you? You're just always hungry. Are you always hungry, Alice? Yeah, always hungry. I'm very hungry. You're very hungry. Daddy bought my skips. Daddy bought you some skips, didn't he? Yeah. So anyway, tonight I'm actually going to the theatre. I'm going to go and see a play. We've seen the Curious Incident of the Dog in the Night Time. I've heard good things about it. So I'm going to go and see that. I think I got £10 off my ticket. There was an offer on. Lawrence isn't going. He wasn't too bothered about going and seeing it. Um, I said he could go on a different night if he wanted to, but he wasn't bothered. So, yeah, I'm going to go see that tonight. So, Lawrence finishes work at 2. I think he's going to be home by around 3. So, I'm hoping to leave maybe by about half 3. Uh, look around Primark, because I've not done that this week. Um, look around the shops and then head to the theatre and get some food while I'm out. I'll just go to KFC because it's cheap. Um, that is my plan for tonight. So, we're looking forward to that. Um... And yeah, that's the part of tonight. Tomorrow, Friday, Lawrence is working. I'm going to do some baking with the kids. I bought some baking um, packs from the shop the other day. Um, so we're going to do that tomorrow. I was going to do it today, but I've not got any eggs. So Lawrence is going to buy some eggs and we're going to do it tomorrow. And then I think yeah, Lawrence is off at the weekend. He's off Saturday, Sunday. So I'm not sure what we're going to do at the weekend. We were hoping the St. Patrick's Day Parade would be on. Because every year it's always on the weekend before st patrick's day and Lawrence has always been working the weekend before and off the weekend after so he's always missed it and then this this year when he's off that weekend it's not on that weekend it's actually been postponed i think till the 27th which is ages after st patrick's day so i don't really see the point of doing the parade because it's that long after st patrick's day but that's when it is so i don't think we'll probably bother going to see it um but yeah st patrick's day next week so i think we said we'd do like a little tea party for the children and um, we'll decorate the house in green and irish flag we'll make some um saint patrick's day cupcakes and biscuits and maybe get some green balloons and have like a little, little party for them because lawrence is off that day so yeah that's the plan for next week and yeah so that's the plan for the day so i'm gonna go and get her her skips now since she's hungry see if leah wants a snack Although Leo doesn't really like any snack foods. He doesn't like fruit. He doesn't like crisps. He, he just doesn't like anything, really. Um, he used to eat bananas for snacks, and now he just will not eat bananas. So the only thing I'll eat is biscuits, and I'm not constantly giving him biscuits. He's already had one, so he's, he'll have to do without a snack if he won't have a banana. I don't know. I'm going to go and get Alice some skips, and I'll get back to you later. Hi, so it is now five o'clock. I'm just about ready to go out um, to the theatre. I'm going to go and get some food first and then maybe have a quick look around the shops. I'm not going to have as much time as I've wanted to look around the shops. I always end up end being late, but anyway, I'm ready now. I'm just going to put everything in my bag and I'm going to head out.
in the food court now. It's actually 10 to 6 and I've only just got like food, so I don't think I'm going to have time to go into Primark. So I think I'm just going to have time to eat this and walk straight to the theatre. So that's what I'm going to have to do. Yeah, got some food, I'm going to eat this quickly and then head to the theatre. So it's now half six, so I'm just walking to the theatre. We're in a different way than usual, so I hope you're all lost. Yeah, it's been pretty sad minutes. So I've just arrived at the theatre now. It is about quarter to seven. So I think I'm going to go and buy myself some chocolates before I go in because there's no key to go in yet, although there is a few coaches waiting to go in. So yeah, I'm just going to look in the shop and then I'll head in. I'm just walking up to the theatre now to head in. I'm just in the theatre now, just bought a programme and a magnet. I think it's about 15 minutes till the auditorium opens, so not too long. So the auditorium is now open. I'm just setting it up to my seat. But the very very top, so a lot of steps to come. Just in the auditorium now, I'll just show you my seat. I'm in the Grand Tier Roquet C14. It does say limited legroom, but there's loads of legroom compared to the seat I was in the other day at 9 to 5. There's loads of legroom in this. So, yeah, I'll show you my seat now. Seat Roquet C14. See, there's lots of legroom in this one. So, plenty of legroom. Nothing like the one in the palace the other day. And then this is the view of the stage. Yeah, it's a really good view. So it's about half an hour now till it starts. So I'm going to read the program. Yeah, just picked up the program. So I'm going to read that now till it starts. So it is now the interval, and it's really, really good. Really enjoying it. Obviously, I'll tell you more about it once I get home. But yeah, it's really good. So. Hi, so I'm now back from the theatre. I think it's about half eleven. Yeah, just coming up to half eleven. I think I've been back for about half an hour. I've just been getting all Elsie's stuff ready for school in the morning because she's got nursery. So I've just been making her lunch and getting all her clothes and stuff all ready so we can just go. In the morning, all she'll have to do is get dressed, give her a breakfast, and she's ready to go and brush teeth and have a wash, obviously. Um, but yeah, so everything's all ready, so it should be quick to get out in the morning. Because I think I'm going to go to town with Leo and go to Primark. Lawrence needs some socks. Um, I could do with a few bits, like some more leggings and stuff. So I think that's what we're going to do, me and Leo, while has is in nursery. And yeah, that's the plan for tomorrow. What day is it? Tomorrow, Friday. My sister's just messaged me and said she wants us to go around on Saturday and try on bridesmaid dresses. So she lives up near Liverpool, so I need to try and work out the trains for that. Um, because Lawrence is off on Saturday, so I can go and do that. And then Sunday, I think we're going to go to Asda, because we need a few bits from Asda. So that's a plan for the rest of the week anyway. But yeah, the show was really good. Really, really enjoyed it. I don't often go to plays. I usually only go to musicals. I have been to a few plays, um, but I've heard good th I heard good things about this one. I thought I'd go, and I just really enjoyed it. It was really, really good. Um, 
cast was great the set was really good i just really enjoyed how they told the story and i thought the story was great so i definitely recommend it if anyone if it's anywhere near you definitely go and see it it was really really good play so i'm gonna watch a little bit of telly and then i'm gonna head to bed so i'll get back to you tomorrow now hi today is friday just dropped Alice off at school now me and Leah are gonna head into town and go to Primark a few things I need to pick up from there and of course you want to sausage roll so I can get one of those while we're there and yeah that's what we're gonna do today I also need to remember to get some eggs so we can do some baking either today or tomorrow I need to remember to do that as well so I'll probably get back to you now once we're in town we're just at the tram station now just waiting for a truck it's due in two minutes, isn't it, Leo? Leo's got his ticket. You got your ticket, Leo? Show Mummy your ticket. There you go, he's got his ticket waiting. There it is. Leo's got his ticket ready. Oh, there it is, Leo. Leo, look at them diggers, look. Look at them diggers. We're just in Leo's favourite place now. He's got his sausage roll. Is that yummy? <laughs> there you go. And I've got bacon rolls. I'm just going to eat this and then we're going to go to the shop. I knew you'd cry. I'll give you your chocolate star. I'm going to have to bribe him with a chocolate star to go in here. Can we get your chocolate star now? Primark now I've just had a look around the clothing section the beauty section I had quite a lot of new Disney stuff actually so I'm gonna do a come shop with me video but yeah there's lots of new stuff in so I'm just going upstairs now to go home and wear it
we've just finished up in Primark now, bought a couple of things. Not much. I'll show you when we get home. I'm just gonna head home and get Alice now. Leo and I just going down to have a quick look in Poundland. So we are back from the shop now, just put, I picked Alice up from nursery, got Leo some lunch and I thought I'd just quickly show you what I picked up from Primark. So I just picked myself up a new nighty. I say nighty, I just wear these as cash, as um, loungewear around the house because it's comfy. Uh, I got in two times extra large, it's the Mickey one. I think it was six pounds. Yeah, six pounds. And I got myself some more socks because my socks keep disappearing. I keep buying new ones and they just disappear. So got some more. They were four pounds. Hope they're the right size. Yeah. I picked myself up some just some cheap new headphones. I keep losing my headphones. Got some socks for Lawrence. And I just put a couple of St. Patrick Day things. We're gonna have like a little tea party because you don't know my husband is from Dublin. So he likes to celebrate St. Patrick's Day. So just got one of these for me or for the for the children. Leo, you want this? Ah! Huh? Wow, look at you, gorgeous boy. Wow, lovely hat, Leo. You like that? Right, let's not break it. We'll save it. That is lovely on you. And then I've got these little necklaces. I was going to use them as decoration or necklaces, I don't know. And then I just got some Easter cutters from Primark and they were £1.50. So, yeah, that's everything we picked up from the shops today. Alice is wearing her bridesmaid dress. Do you like your dress? Yeah. You're very pretty, aren't you? Yeah. You're very pretty. Hey. She likes her dress and she likes her shoes. Ow. These are her, stop jumping. These are her shoes and they fit her lovely. We left her socks on, but we'll take them off. But, oh, and she's excited to go to the wedding party, aren't you? You're going to go to the wedding party? I got my colour. Oh, well, let's try the other dress on. Now that one is very pretty. We'll try the next one on. So here's Alice wearing her next dress and her lovely coat. Twirl round so we can see your coat. Twirl? You twirl? Oh wow, beautiful. Oh, I zip it up. Okay, come here and zip it up. There you go, Alice is twirling. She wanted to see it from the back. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful, Alice. Let's go party. Let's go party. So this is her party dress and party coat. And then this is her shoes for the wedding. She's bridesmaid, so we just had to try them on. So these are her bridesmaid shoes, and this is her bridesmaid dress. Don't, don't. Oh, I also need to try this on that I bought her before because she's not tried it on, but this is probably going to be for Leo's birthday party. No, it's for me. Alice's birthday party. That's for Leo. No, that one's for the wedding. This one is for the birthday party. There's two parties. There's Leo's birthday party, and there's the wedding, so you need two dresses. Don't you? You need one for the birthday party and one for the wedding. So this one's for the birthday party and this one's for the wedding party. Yeah. Only for wedding day. 
Yeah, wedding day, that's right. Today's Saturday, I am just off to my sister's, which is near Liverpool, because we've gone to try and brighten my dresses today. I need to be super quick, because I think I'm going to miss the train. I've only got like half an hour to get it, it's going to take me much longer. I have to get the next one, be late, so I'll get back to you at the train station. now and I'm just walking up to my sister's. I've never actually been to my sister's before. I've been once in Florence and then my sister met us at the train station and walked us to the house and so she's Google Maps. So hopefully I'll find it. She's done a nine minute walk from the station. So hopefully it's not too hard to find so yeah. Hi so it's actually Sunday now it's actually Sunday evening everyone else is in bed. I'm really sorry I didn't get back to you yesterday after I went to my sister's Tram Bridesmaid's dresses. Um, I was there for quite a few hours actually. I think I didn't get home until um, nearly six o'clock. Um, so yeah, we were there quite a while. She gave us some lunch and everything. It was really nice. She's decided on the bridesmaid's dresses she wants and they're really, really nice. Um, they're a nice navy colour. So they're really pretty. Obviously I can't show you them because she won't want anyone seeing them till the wedding. But yeah, they're really, really pretty dresses. And yeah, I'm really looking forward to wearing it, it should be really nice. Luckily I didn't have to get the train home, one of the other bridesmaids um, lives close by so she said she'd give me a lift home, which was really really nice of her, so at least I didn't have to get the train or anything home, um, and it was a lot quicker with her driving as well, it didn't seem to take very long at all, I think it took about maybe half an hour, um, as opposed to it, I think it took me, I left the house just after half ten, and I didn't get there till one o'clock. So yeah, it took quite a while to get there, um, but yeah, it was a lovely day. And then when we got home, I was just really tired because socialising with people I don't know really makes me really tired. Um, so yeah, I was really tired when I got home. So I just had my dinner and then me and Lawrence were both tired, so we ended up going to bed early. Um, so yeah, nothing much happened once we got once I got home. And then today we've just all been tired. We were going to go to Asda. But there wasn't really anything we really desperately needed from Asda and Lawrence was really tired today and so we thought, you know what, we'll just go another day. Lawrence is off on Tuesday, so I think we're just going to go Tuesday because we weren't desperate for anything from Asda today. So, yeah, we're going to go Tuesday instead. So, yeah, we haven't really done very much. I've been doing a bit of editing on the computer. Um, Alice has done some playing. Alice has played with Lawrence upstairs because on train tracks. And that's all we've really done, so there wasn't really anything to film. Um, but yeah, next week we've got a few things on next week and um, tomorrow I'm going to the theatre to see Dreamboats and Petticoats so that should be good um, Tuesday Lawrence is off so I think Tuesday we're going to go to Asda um, Wednesday I'm going to do some baking with the children because it's St Patrick's Day on Thursday and we're going to have like a little tea party so I'm going to make some like cakes and biscuits and some things for that on Thursday Obviously Thursday we're going to have our little St. Patrick's Day tea party. Friday, not sure what we're doing Friday yet. Um, me and Leo might go into town on Friday while Alice is at nursery. And then Saturday, is Lauren's off on Saturday? Not sure. Not sure. I think my parents said they'd have the kids on Saturday actually so I can get some stuff done around the house. And then Sunday, not sure what we're doing. But that is the plan so far for next week. So I don't think I've filmed very much this week, but hopefully you've still enjoyed the vlog. Um, like I said, we're doing more next week, so next week might be a bit more interesting. And yeah, so I hope you have enjoyed it. If you have, please do give it a like. Don't forget to subscribe, and I hope to see you again next week. Bye.